plant stoves, the guys needed an excuse to build one. With our new earth bag structure, the plan is to put one in. But that's a few months away. Due to the cost of propane on a radiant floor in our first earth bag structure, it made it an easy target for our next project. The guys decide on a space heater rocket stove. I know, it kind of sounds spacey. This is Garen. Mm. Here's the plan. Working with a steel pipe, he will make a J-tube. The idea is to build a fire in one end of the tube where the heat and smoke will exhaust out the other end. A draft from the exhaust will force the fire to burn sideways up and out of the pipe. Using a steel bucket, the J-pipe will be insulated to make a fire burn hotter and create the rocketing effect. He will place a section of an old hot water tank over the exhaust to create the combustion chamber. The intense fire will reburn the smoke to emit steam, CO2, and a small amount of smoke as an exhaust. The chamber is vented out the back of the stove. I'm having a hard time testing with all this wind, but I say it's working. A hole has to be cut through the earth bag wall. This is an easy task for the sawzall. It has to get through both the dirt and the barbed wire. Boy, these walls are sure easy to work with. The rocket heater is moved into space. I mean place. Now for the test. One small step for mankind. One giant leap for the homestead family. Uh, I can't do this with my eyes. Nope, no fan. Okay, so the first run of this was kind of a bust. We had lots of smoke. Uh, we had a great deal of problems with the draft. So I'm going to take it back to the drawing board and take another look at it. Here's the new plan. We thought two things were messing up the rocket stove's ability to draft. We needed to lower the firebox and increase the length of stovepipe up and out. The adjustments are made. made higher this time to allow for a higher exhaust. The holes are patched with some cob. Uh, do you see us gals? Just wanted to point that out. I actually did participate in the whole rocket space thing. Prepare yourself for liftoff. Do we get a countdown or a drum roll or something? Ow. The eagle has landed. We're starting to feel some heat coming out of this thing. If it's uh, drafting properly. This time, it works. Now it's time to design one in the dining room in the dining room. The boys need an excuse to build one. We might want to use the word guys. They're a little sensitive that way. Ah, uh, is, not was, as we haven't done it yet. I, this is ridiculous. Okay. Testing? Is this thing on? Oh. <laughs> And now to a Z inside your mouth. <laughs> Mom, Dad's having me do baby sounds. <laughs> <laughs>